is sponsored by Utah Film Center. If you and your family love a good movie, then grab the popcorn. You will not want to miss Tumbleweeds Film Festival for kids that's happening this weekend. Mariah is here with all the details. Welcome, Mariah. Thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. I'm so excited to have you, and I want to talk about this film festival. What is it exactly? Well, the Tumbleweeds Film Festival is geared towards kids ages 4 to 14. Um, you know, kids at that age really don't have the opportunity to experience independent cinema mm -hmm. and they don't have the opportunity to experience foreign films very often those things are just not available on streaming services typically and so the tumbleweeds film festival now in our 11th year uh, gives an opportunity for kids to experience films from all over the world as well as some learning some hard skills you know workshops and stuff to learn how to become a filmmaker i love it let's talk about you guys have an online arm of this film festival when is that happening yeah so the in-person festival happens this weekend friday through sunday and then starting on sunday may 22nd through may 29th we'll have a bunch of the films available online so for families that are not close to proximity of taylorsville uh, maybe some barriers to uh, participating you know can't get out of the house they can still watch these films too. I love it, there's an option for everyone. What type of films can people expect to see? Oh, you know, my favorite films are usually the short film, the short animated films. Mm -hmm. They're from around the world. Um, I watched several of them this morning and they're just so touching and really allows a kid to think about, you know, different cultures. Um, transport some around the world. Um, you don't need to also understand subtitles to watch animation films. I think we were talking about that before this interview and I think that's such a cool thing because people may not realize that but I love that you guys have that and you have activities too. Let's talk about that. Yeah so the activities are all geared towards becoming a filmmaker or advancing your skills as a filmmaker. So if you're interested in learning how to register and do solo flights with your drone, if you want to learn how to act for a camera, you're interested in animation, we have very inexpensive workshops that just start to get that that interest going that's incredible I love the filmmaking workshop aspect that's amazing um, you guys actually have an opportunity for people to win tickets so let's talk about that we do so we have four uh, family six packs so day passes are very inexpensive six dollars a person and wow. it's, it gets you into all the films all the activities for the day and then the workshops are just a little bit of additional charge on there ten dollars uh, but we're giving away four family six packs that's incredible. I know, bring the whole family down and there's actually free transportation if you use your tickets on Trax or UTA. I love that. Okay, so you have no excuse not to go. Really quick, tell me what makes this festival in general just kind of different from other ones that are out there. You know, it's an opportunity to be with people and to really explore film. You know, uh, we have some amazing film festivals in the state. I think you've heard of one of them called Sundance. <laughs> but a chance to take your kids and explore these subjects with them. Most of our families that attend there reply back and say that it was a chance to have a deeper conversation about the content that they watch and about communities all over the world. I love that. That's incredible. It's such a cool message. Um, Mariah, it's such a pleasure sitting down with you. Where can people go for more information in general? You can go to Tumbleweeds Kids org or utahfilmcenter.org. I love it. So exciting. Well, best of luck. It's going to be a really fun time. Thank you. Thank you.